See, we, we can get mixed up by thinking we're doing a good thing, but a good thing is not a God thing. David, David was David was engrossed in doing some good things. He noticed he's in a nice ivory palace, or he's in a nice palace, and, and he's got he's got nice things, and looks out the window, and his best friend God is living in a tent, and decides I'm going to have to bring God up to my level, and and, and, and he starts to make him build God a house, and God said I didn't tell you to build me no house. Now what evil? David wasn't in sin. But it just wasn't a, a God thing. It was a good thing, but not a God thing. We, we don't have a lot of, enough time to fulfill all the good things that need to be done. We need to find out what God wants us to do. And so we have to, we have to learn to unclutter our lives from what God did not tell us to do and who He did not tell us to hang around and get connected to who God did connect us to. These ministry friends that I have uh, met many new, many, many of, of them are acquaintances. I consider uh, Pastor Rogers and Pastor Lawrence, Bishop Young, I, I, I consider them bone relationships, connections that God put in my life. You, you remember the story of Ezekiel 37 where the prophet came to down, comes down in the, in, the, in the valley of dry bones. And then he says there is a shaking. Son, you go. 